Do the days of Genesis 1 refer to long periods of time? Well, the answer is no, they can't. You see, when you take the Hebrew language, as it's written in Genesis 1 there, the Hebrew word yom, for day, whenever it's qualified with the word evening, or the word morning, or a number, or has the phrase evening and morning, that means it's an ordinary day. Look up any Hebrew dictionary, that's what it'll tell you. Really, the people who say the days are long periods of time are those who are trying to fit man's ideas of millions of years into the Bible. And you should never take man's word outside the Bible and try and fit it into the Bible. We start from God's word, and we know God created everything in six days, rested for one day, that's where our seven day week comes from.